home. Your brother, bless his soul, is summoning me as I speak. Make a deal, bring you back. It's exactly what I was talking about, isn't it? It's all become so expected. You have to believe me. When I suggested you take on the mark of Cain, I didn't know this was going to happen. Not really. I mean, I might not have told you the entire truth. But I never lied. I never lied, Dean. That's important. It's fundamental. There is one story about Cain that I might have forgotten to tell you. Apparently, he too was willing to accept death rather than becoming the killer that Mark wanted him to be. So he took his own life with the blade. He died. Except, as rumor has it, the mark never quite let go. You can understand why I never spoke of this. Why set hearts aflutter at mere speculation. It wasn't until you summoned me. No. It wasn't truly until you left that cheeseburger uneaten. And I began to let myself believe maybe miracles do come true. Listen to me, Dean Winchester. What you're feeling right now, it's not death. It's life, a new kind of life. Open your eyes, Dean. See what I see, feel what I feel. Let's go take a howl at that moon. 